Hey guys, today I'm reviewing the Graz 4 inch brass pocket caliper. I gotta say, this is an awesome idea for an everyday carry type tool for making small precise measurements. So the caliper is made of solid brass. It is a two piece, well actually it's a, it's a three piece. It looks like this um, has two seams on the side. The only thing I would be worried about is if this comes undone at some point. And it allows you to make both inside and outside measurements. It's got both a metric as well as an SAE scale. And it comes with this uh, plastic uh, carrying case, a little bit flimsy and the, the, some residue left over from all the stickers. So I may toss this and pick up a uh, leather carrying case for it. The numbers are both written as well as engraved, not super deep, but they're, you, you, you can feel them when you run your finger over it. And let's test it out to see just how precise this thing is. So here I have a couple of items that we for sure know the size of. One is a quarter inch drive magnetic impact driver adapter. So we know that this end is quarter inch, so let's Go ahead and put that in there and check our measurement. And it looks like the inside marker is exactly at one fourth. Well, I mean, it's, it's a hair under one fourth, but I would say that's good enough. Now let's check the inside. So it's almost at its maximum capacity or rather minimum capacity. Um, but the inside measurement is also one fourth and we know that to be true for this particular adapter now let's try something a little bit bigger uh, we have this milwaukee trim square so let me bring this to two and a half inches for example okay and that looks to be exactly at two and a half awesome Next, I have a 10 millimeter Allen key or Allen wrench. So let's see the metric scale, just how accurate that is. So let's just do it from this side. Okay. And our inside measurement is at exactly 10 millimeters. So, so far this thing is doing great. Now, real world example and something that I actually used this caliper tool for the other day. So I had a fastener that I needed to identify um, to call basically the, the big box store and figure out if they have it in stock. Um, I didn't really know, I couldn't really tell the size, obviously it was, wasn't written on there. So it wasn't this lag bolt, but this lag bolt would be an awesome example. So this is a 5 16th lag bolt. And we know that 5 16th lag bolts have half inch hex heads. So in this example, I'm on the job site. I need a replacement bolt. I need another bolt, whatever the reason. I don't have to, you know, guess and check. I don't have to bring the bolt with me. I, if I have somebody in the field who's doing, you know, the shopping trips, I can give them a call and say, hey, I need you to pick something up that's approximately half inch hex head. Um, I don't think this caliper would work for precision wood or metal work uh, for making your final measurements before you cut or attach something. Uh, I do think that this is an awesome tool for when you're out in the field and let's say you have a piece of pipe or something that you need to figure out the diameter quickly. It doesn't have to be super approximate. Uh, as we know, you know, conduit, for example, comes in three quarter inch, one inch, one and a half inch, one and a quarter inch. Right. And this tool is precise enough to tell you that information without having to like pull out your tape measure and awkwardly, awkwardly measure the diameter. Um, so for that reason, I am very happy with this as an everyday carry tool. I think this makes a lot of sense, whether you just want to carry it in your pocket. I'm going to have it in my everyday carry tool bag. Uh, like I said, I would look for another carrying case because this doesn't seem like it's going to last very long. Uh, but definitely a worthy investment gets my thumbs up.